This is Indonesian food. Indonesian fusion. Take Indonesian food to the next level, higher level. And it happened in United States. Fine dining. Wow. Can you believe that? Curious, proud. Keep watching this video until the end. It's so beautiful. Is this beautiful, guys? Wow. Wow. Look at that. Welcome back to my channel, The David D. America. Everything about travel, food, adventure, and daily vlog. Today, we are going to try Indonesian food, not the traditional one or from the food truck, but it's from Indonesian restaurant. It's Indonesian fusion. It brings Indonesian food to the higher level. Fine dining which surprised me because it exists in the United States. Is it good? Is it worth it? Can it compete with American food? Let's find out shortly. Before that, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, like, comment, and share. Also, turn notification on so you will not miss my next video. Alright guys, I'm at Indonesian restaurant here, named Indo Restaurants and Lounge. Right now, I have mixed feeling between proud and curious to know there is Indonesian fancy restaurant with, of course, higher price in United States. Here we go. Let's go in. This is the first time for me to go to fancy Indonesian restaurant here. The place look nice from outside. Hi. Hi. So you call, right? Yes, we call. Indonesian? No, actually I'm Thai, but our chef is Indonesian. Ah. Uh, Look at the outdoor dining, guys. Looks so nice and romantic. Also, look at the indoor dining. The indoor dining also looks beautiful. It's just a little bit dark. It's still quiet here because we came too early. Here is the menu. Well, I saw a lot of Indonesian food listed here. Such as ayam goreng, satay, beef rendang, balado, bali ribs, sambal, and many more. This is what we order. We order gado gado. Hmm, look yummy. Martabak. Chicken satay. Mi goreng. Looks so tasty. Of course. Beef rendang. Sayur lodeh. Black pepper brown. The presentation is excellent. The food look yummy. Let's me try. The sayur lode. Look at that. Look delicious. Very nice presentation. With green curry. It's not like in Indonesia with coconut milk. The color is not green. Usually is white. Even though the color here is green and different with Indonesian sayur lode. But let's see. If the taste is similar with Indonesian sayur lodeh, this is the tofu, some vegetable, eggplant, long bean, cabbage, tomato,
even though the soup color is green from the green curry, but the taste is there. Remind me to Indonesian sayur lode. It's very good. It's very beautiful presentation, isn't it? Wow! They bring it the next level of sayur lodeh. It's very good, creamy, but the taste of sayur lodeh, like in Indonesia, it's still there. Perfect. Let's try the satay. The chicken itself is tender, little bit salty, little bit sweet. It's perfect. Mmm, yummy. One portion, it has six sticks. The peanut sauce, cucumber. Let's try with the peanut sauce. The taste is good. The peanut sauce is a little bit tangy, creamy, thick, and delicious. The presentation is also very nice. Add it with cucumber for the freshness, even though the original Indonesian satay doesn't have cucumber. The peanut sauce looks more liquid than the original. The satay ayam is a little bit different than satay ayam in Indonesia. The lodeh itself is almost close to sayur lodeh in Indonesia. The satay ayam is good, it's just different taste, not like Indonesia satay ayam. Let's try this one. It's not really Indonesian food, but it looks good. That's why I also order it. Pepper blackens brown. It's brown with noodle. Let's try the noodle. The noodle is so smoky, salty, sweet at the same time. Not overcooked. It's perfect. The noodle on salty side. It has four brown inside. Big brown. The taste is same thing. Smoky. Delicious. Let's try the rendang. The presentation of this rendang is also very nice. It just looks like traditional Indonesian rendang. What is rendang? Rendang is Indonesian dish of beef cooked slowly in coconut milk and spices. It also looks so delicious. Look at that. Rendang. Potato. Coconut milk. Let's try out. Hmm. The beef is so tender. The coconut milk of the rendang is good, but on the sweet side, beef is tender. Delicious, melted in the mouth. The rendang is perfect. Look at that. Wow! Let's try the mie goreng. Indonesian noodle. It has noodle, shrimp, egg as usual, Vegetable, bell pepper. Look at that, guys. It looks delicious. The noodle is not overcooked. 
little bit salty, little bit sweet, but on the sweet side. It's good. Remind me to Indonesian bakmi. Simple, sweet, and tasty. Next is gado gado Indonesian salad. Look at that. It has cabbage, green bean, bean sprout, tofu, eggs, and of course, peanut sauce. The vegetable is fresh. The peanut sauce is delicious. Reminds me of Indonesian food, traditional gado gado. Next, I'm going to try martabak. Martabak is folded omelette pancake with some vegetable. Sometimes it can be filled with chicken or beef. And this is the martabak. Yes, the martabak is a little bit different than Indonesian martabak that I expected. But let's see if this is also good. This is Indonesian fusion. Takes that to different higher level than Indonesian traditional food. That's why the price is a little bit higher than traditional Indonesian food. The inside is beef. The beef is delicious, but little bit greasy. The aftertaste, you feel greasiness on the lips, but it's good. Overall, guys, the food is very good. It's not like Indonesian traditional food, but it's Indonesian fusion. It brings it to higher level different level than Indonesian traditional food. It's more like fine dining. You still can taste it like Indonesian food. Sayur lodeh. You still can taste sayur lodeh like in Indonesia. The bakmi goreng. Like Indonesian traditional bakmi goreng. Rendang. The beef is so tender. Just melt it in the mouth when you eat it. The coconut milk is very good. More liquid than Indonesian traditional rendang. You see that? It's more liquid than traditional Indonesian rendang. However, the taste is there. Delicious. The satay is good, but it's not like Indonesian satay. The gado gado is very good. The peanut sauce is tasty, so tasty, tangy. The vegetable is so fresh. Still remind you like gado gado in Indonesia. Will I come back to here? The price on the high end. For example, sayur lodeh. It's seventeen dollar. The rendang is twenty four dollar. This one is $18, even though the price is high. But this is Indonesian fusion, a different level, higher level than Indonesian traditional food. Still reasonable price. Will I come back here? Hmm, yes, absolutely, I will come back here. Why? Because the food is overall is delicious. That's all my review today. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share this video. And turn notification on so you will not miss my next video. Thank you again for watching. Bye-bye.